Celtics. Um, do you think, are you, are you going to appeal to the bigger audience? Oh, or yes. Is it going to to, or is it going to appeal to the audience of Scott FM where we attracted everybody? Is it going to, is it going to have the same effect? I think, it, well, FM? hopefully it will have the same effect. But, I mean, it's difficult to know if it will have the same effect as Scott FM because nobody had ever done it. Since then, we've had one or two Scotty McClue attempts at sound alikes. Mm. You know, and but to be thing, honest... But the thing is, but the thing is, Scott, sorry to interrupt you, but the thing is, no. you, 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 you go back to the Scott FM days again, we were spoken with it previously, you know, quarter of a million calls every half hour or whatever, you know... Quarter of a million <laughs> listeners every half hour, 460,000 calls in the week. I mean, do you think you could... Get back up to that say calibre of calls or or means people like myself who have been listening to you, you know, for thirty years. Yes. You know, I remember I mean I remember all them. I, I remember those calls. I remember every single night, Sunday to Thursday, ten to one, as I as I always put up. Well the calls um, were outstanding because what we did with the calls was either it was a serious call, a genuine call, a funny call, a wind up call, all sorts of things. <laughs> And where I used to get annoyed at people saying, I, I think that was maybe a plant call. They were very, very, very few and far between. So the calls were coming just off the street, so to speak. Mm. You see, and the very fact that that was happening was what made the show so much fun. The thing is, you didn't know what your next call was going to be. One minute you get a guy, you know, all right, Scotty, and screaming on the phone, and then you get some John telling you they're like problems. Yeah, absolutely. You got that. You got that sort of stuff. You know, I can remember being on a program on BBC Radio Four, and a guy was attacking me. He said, "You don't have a support network. You're not a professional counsellor." And I said, "No, but if we've saved one life, then it's worth doing, and we've saved many." And that just sorted him out. I think he was annoyed with me for saying it. You know, and 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 it's true. Do you not remember a guy came on one night? And he said he was thinking in taking his life. We talked to him for a while and I said, will you excuse me until after the commercial break? Uh, um, I we had to, we had to take the breaks on time and because uh, the advertisers had paid, otherwise you have no radio station. And, uh, um, and he was there for me when we got back. I said to him, don't, do you, don't, don't you dare go anywhere. I'll be back to you in two minutes. But do you think a new, say, talk show, talking, would be as successful as Scott FM? I mean, uh, well, Scott like, FM was the finest hour on the whole history of Scottish oh, no, radio. No, no, it was the best, you know, days of, again, growing up, as I said to you previously, you know, I used to lie and listen to you every night. But, say, friends, if you do a, a new talk on the radio, you know, is it going to be a daytime? You know, is a different audience? No, it'll be, this one will be a night time, probably you know, so 10 to midnight. You see, that the, the, the only thing you're up against, remember, see, when I started on Scott FM, there was no internet to speak of. Virtually nobody had a mobile phone worth talking about. So you're, you were one of the big sources of entertainment. Mm. Now, the thing is, you look at the time people spend on their phones. Because there's so much media, you look how their concentration levels have plummeted and they're happy with wow. things 10 seconds long. Mm. So uh, would they uh, get through a three-hour phone in the way you and I did? Probably not, because you probably listen to go like that. I'll myself, of course, there's no YouTube uh, or too busy doing TikToks or too busy doing this and the next thing. Yes. You know, you'll probably find that, you know, you will... You will appeal. You will appeal to a certain audience. I mean, I'll certainly listen to you definitely. But as I say, here's I this. Here, shall I dump this?